Hello, this is my first video and I've made these for my brother and sister-in-law's wedding. I offered to make them a signing book. So I started with this journal which became a bit epic and then I decided <laughs> I liked it too much and it just seemed too precious to use as a signing book. I didn't like the idea of anyone writing in it apart from, you know, something that she really wanted something special for. So I decided to make this little simple journal um, little flip out for the signing instead. So she loves sunflowers. I think they're having sunflowers at the wedding and um, they love the beach. So I made her a beach one for her birthday and she loved it. So I'm pretty sure she's going to like this. So this is the simple signing book. There's only a small amount of people there for the wedding and this is it's going to be big enough definitely so a little bookmark and just plain tea sta stained paper with some little bits and pieces in it for them which goes with the journal so that's it's pretty cute actually I, I really like it and I'm sure that they're gonna love it so that's the signing book and the journal which she can use to keep memories and things from for the wedding or you know obviously do whatever they want um michael my brother is a scorpio <laughs> and as i said they love the beach so this is the journal that i ended up making so I, I I did purchase a kit offline and I've um, just kept it reasonably simple really used some a few pages from a garden book did a little bit of water painting they were the first ones I tried and I've grown a little bit since then so lots of um, little tags and things that can be written on or used as bookmarks. This is one of her favourite poems or her favourite poet. So lots of little hidey holes. And after um, she got her birthday present, which is a little bit smaller than this one, her, I think his 10 year old son, whom I haven't met yet, but excited to meet, was really excited by the journal and just wants to know how to make one himself. So I'm going to take a little kit up for the kids so that they can actually do their own little one. Because he wants to pick my brain apparently, but... I've only learnt just just recently myself. So this is the one of the patterns that I used for her wedding, uh, her birthday album. So I've made sure I've popped some of that in here and in here, just to carry the theme through for her. And she's also a musician. It's more of a piano, but, um, you know, that's what I had. So, and these, um, I'd seen other people use stickers, but I had never done it myself. So I tried using the black and white stickers. I really liked the way it turned out. And now I did the stamping in behind. So another piece of that garden book. Just some little quotes and little pictures of them. That they can have a bit of fun with. And I, I don't have a great printer. I've just got an inkjet printer, but um, they've come out well for a present. I wouldn't be able to sell it, but definitely for a little present little bookmarks and 
more for them. Plenty of places to write. I'm pretty sure she does journaling, so like she likes to write things down. And there we go. That is one of my first journals. Oh, well, I've done a few, but that's definitely my first um, video anyway. I really enjoy doing them. So I've been doing lots of this creative type thing as presents for people. I'm not buying presents anymore and no, I'm just I'm loving it. So hopefully it will be loved and treasured for the wedding. I'm sure it will be. I know it will be. So thank you.